The hole swallowed everything in its path. My child, my wife. During times of starvation, it was justified. Raising a child was a luxury. Even if you threw your child in the hole, you would not be ostracized by anyone. But my wife didn't acknowledge it. The reality of not being able to raise our child. That the child had already fallen in the hole and died. She didn't acknowledge it. Perhaps because she was in denial of everything. Like a child throwing a fit, she became a child herself. My maddened wife spent half the day acting like a child. I had to soothe and comfort her. Those around me gave me sympathy. Sympathy for the fact that I had barely gotten rid of a child, only to get another. I had no choice but to throw the new child into the hole. When the child was falling into the hole, my wife returned momentarily. As I stared into my wife's eyes, I couldn't remove the sick feeling from my stomach. Then I realized that something had gone wrong. My wife's necklace. I should have thrown her without the necklace. Her necklace was ten days worth of food. I thrashed in agony. Tortured by starvation, I needed the necklace. I carefully climbed down the hole using a rope. The hole was deep and spacious. I waved the torchlight around, but I couldn't see the child I had thrown first or my wife, nor the something that was rumored to live in the hole. I moved on to the deeper parts of the hole. Suddenly, I heard my wife's and my child's voice. Oh God, had the child survived? I planned on carefully coaxing the two to retrieve the necklace. I hurried towards their voice. As I waved my torchlight in front of me, I saw a large boulder. The sound was coming from the boulder. I used all my might to push it. The boulder started to flinch until it opened up as if it was stretching its arm out from a slumber. It wasn't a boulder. It was a massive and grotesque scorpion monster. The rumors were true. There was something that engulfed everything below in the hole. I realized that the hole didn't only swallow my wife and my child, but me as well.